Too long. I waited way too long. Uh, I, I, I mean, so I, I had been to physical therapy previously um, uh, for for a, a continuing spinal condition, uh, but after getting into a car accident, I waited o almost an entire year before I pursued physical therapy again, which was it was pretty pretty awful idea. I, I really should have just gotten in there right away. I mean, there was a certain part of me that just thought, you know, oh, if, if I just continue doing my exercises from previous physical therapy, if I just keep, you know, on top of it, it it'll be fine, it'll, it'll, it'll go back to how it was, but um, with, with re-injuring it, you know, I really needed, I really needed um, the attentions of a professional, um, especially a professional like Carlo, um, who could help me get back to that sort of, you know, base level and then, and then go on from there. Everything. Sleep. A lot of sleep. I was missing out on sleep. I was missing out on um, having, you know, like fun and freedom. I wasn't able to do what I wanted to do on the weekends. I had to constantly take care of my back and, and you know, make sure that I wasn't straining myself, wasn't risking an injury just so that I wasn't missing work and school, those things that, you know, we have to do. So I couldn't do any of the things I wanted to do for fear of not being able to do the things I had to. Primarily the, the just going back and doing the old exercises, which were primarily from, from physical therapy I had been doing nearly a decade ago. So, so much has changed in the world of physical therapy, so much has improved in the, the methods and practices that I just, I, you know, I, I, I couldn't even get back to that baseline, much less get past it. While, while I had a pretty you know good understanding of physical therapy, I think um, if, when you're working with Carlo, he's he's so good at specifically tailoring it to the person, and he's so aware of of how each individual's body works slightly differently, and is is able to uh, you know accommodate that, accommodate all the little differences. Um, and so I kind of thought, you know, that it was, that it was rote, that it was cookie cutter. Um, and after coming to Carlo, you know, it's, it's really this super individually tailored experience that, I mean, is, is, is perfect. You get your butt in there. Like, I mean, absolutely. It's, it's, it, there, there's... There's no reason to to wait because uh, as you wait, the, the the pain gets worse, the injury gets worse. You're doing more things that are furthering that injury, and you know e even if it's just to come in and and knowing Carlo, he would tell you if you didn't need to be in here. But you know even if it's just to come in to to sort of figure out where you need to go, like where where. Uh, how to make progress on the injury, whether it's, you know, a really light regimen with Carlo followed by, you know, uh, an exercise plan that you pursue on your own, whether, whether it is coming in here three or four times a week, whatever it is that, that you need, it's, the only way to figure that out is to get in and work with a physical therapist who's going to, I mean, set you up so that, you know, you could succeed. Well, and I, I think I already mentioned it, but, you know, uh, Carlo really tailors the experience to, to each individual. He understands how your body works and how each person has slightly different ways in which their body works, as well as different goals, what, what they want to be able to do. Um, and so he makes sure that you get up to the level where you want to be. So it's, it's not about meeting some baseline or getting the bare minimum. It's about getting to the point where you're able to do what you want to do. I mean, I, I, I think the number one thing I would say is, is, is to come in and try it out, especially if, you know, you're, you're really experiencing a lot of pain that, that you, you think might be able to be helped by a physical therapist. Um, th there's no reason not to come in and at least talk to you guys to, to um, you know, figure out whether there, there is something that can be done at the very least. And then, you know, from that point, 
you know, do a couple of sessions, see if you start to feel better because, you know, e even though you're not going to be fixed right away, you can, you can see after each session the improvements that you're making in the little ways and range of motion increasing a little bit and strength increasing a little bit. So, I mean, I'd, I'd say it's, it's worth trying. It, there, there's no reason not to try. So, so I'm a huge nerd. So one of the things I wanted to be able to achieve was to be able to go out and um, and and camp out with my friends and do the nerdy stuff we were doing before, where we we fought with foam swords and we would be out there for 40 hours a weekend. And I wanted to get to back to the point where I was able to sleep on the ground and be woken up in the middle of the night and charge out of my tent and fight whatever I had to fight. And um, that that's that's where I've gotten. I mean. Um, every, every time I come in here, Carlo is, is making sure that, you know, we're working on getting me, getting me further, making sure that we're, we're making it so that, um, now I can sleep there the entire weekend. Now I'm not afraid to, you know, run down, um, you know, the mile down to one end of our site and then back up carrying my backpack and all of my gear. Uh, making sure that you know I'm going to be comfortable uh, lying on a hard cot or the ground, um, so that each time I'm coming in and each time we've gotten to to that that first step, each time we've succeeded in in getting me to the place I wanted to be before, you know, he says, okay, now where do you want to be? And so I'm I'm able to to track that progress. I'm able to see myself improving in in what I'm able to do.